Okay, so from right now until 8 p.m. here in the Valley, you can show up to adopt dogs affected by the storm. Maria Hechenova is in Mesa to show us where you can go. Superstition Farm sits on 30 acres of land in Mesa. The operations manager says after hearing a shelter in Texas needed help making more room for surrendered animals, she partnered with other Valley businesses to help. We're a dairy farm. We've never, uh, we're not a pet rescue, but uh, we're stepping out of our circle here. Here's our store. We normally don't have animals in here, but we've kind of turned it into a temporary housing until our fur babies find their forever home. Oh, you wanted to do forever home, huh? Kelly Kunkel went to Texas last week and brought home a total of 12 dogs from a rescue group in Beaumont. We have the space. Um, let's go rescue some animals and bring them back. We wanted to take pet, um, some animals off of her hands so she can continue to take um, dogs that were affected, cats, um, different animals that were affected by the storm. Eight have been adopted. These four are still available. <laughs> a Queen Creek Veterinary Clinic gave them a checkup for free. <laughs> but pets are not the farm's only focus. They're working with other Valley companies through WeHelpTexas.org to drive supplies to Texas. A load is expected to hit the road Saturday. We're not just sending stuff to somebody and saying, hey, give this out. We're going down there ourselves. We're down on the ground helping pass out the stuff. There's no adoption fee for these animals. Coming up at 6 p.m. on 3TV, I'll tell you when the next group of them are expected to come in. In Mesa, Maria Hachinova, 3TV.